What's going on, comrades? My name's Crazy Wyatt. Oh, how you guys doing? Yes, I know. I got a haircut. Big whoop. Also, it's been a, it's been a long time. It's been a while since I I uh, I've spoken and just thought talk to any of you guys. You're, you know, you see my face for once in my freaking life besides the games. Uh, what was I going with this? Oh yeah, I have a very special announcement. We are going to Nebraska. Hell yeah. The reason? What's going on with my hair? <laughs> and rock on. Rock on, bro. <laughs> yeah, we're going to Nebraska because my mom's brother Greg, I told you guys about him, he's he's getting married. And we're going back to our freaking childhood neighborhood, Scottsbluff, Nebraska. And I'm going to tell you this, it's been 13 years since we've been there. I mean, we've, I've lived in Tucson most of my life. But Nebraska was like the best time, I guess, in my life, kind of. It was it was like the most peaceful. You could do whatever you want when you were a kid, kind of thing. But that's okay. It's, we're going back now, and we're gonna we're gonna have, have a road trip. We're we're gonna take this on the road, and we're gonna drive all the way out there, see everybody, have a good time. Crazy Wyatt goes on vacation. Hell yeah! And I'm bringing you guys along with me. <laughs> Bring my comrades along for the ride, right? Hell yeah! Hell yeah, man! Hell yeah! <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah. If you haven't noticed, my hair is weird. Not long, but that's a, that's not gonna interfere with the retaliation. It's just the beginning. I haven't forgot about it. It's a little project, okay? But yeah, I, I just went on a supply run and just grabbed a whole bunch of goodies for the road, just because without food, we're probably gonna kill each other. All the way. I I don't know what what it was like. It was a. Uh, this is Tucson, and Nebraska is like another state away. So there's like one state in the middle. I think it's Wyoming or something. But it's like, it's a weird drive. I'm gonna uh, sit down in this seat I found next to a trash can. It works. Plus I get to use it for video games, man. Use it for gaming. I got toothbrushes. I just noticed that. What, what do we got? What is this? Premier travel toothbrush? Premier? I'm not that fancy. I got a pink one. Yay! <laughs> Woo! But yeah, we're going on vacation. I, I haven't really packed much. Plus, oh, oh, they took my laundry. They took my laundry. There was a white basket right there. It was a white hamper for laundry, and they just took it. Hello, me. Hey, man. How you doing? Wow, look at that handsome devil. Huh? Oh. Yeah. Still missing my tooth. Still beautiful without it. Thirsty, hang on. I just need a... Ah. Ah. <laughs> wow. <laughs> but yeah, that's all I want to say. We're going on vacation. <laughs> There's a wedding going on. And I'm going to show you, comrades, where I grew up in Scotts Bluff, Ar uh, not, not Arizona, screw that, Scotts Bluff, Nebraska. Seriously, you guys will love it. I, I, I'm getting, uh, I can already see it, like the, the valleys, the bridges. It, it was a beautiful place. And I kind of hurt myself a lot as a kid there. I broke my leg on a slide. I hit my head on a rusty nail. And some other weird stuff, a little side stuff. But... Until then, I'll see you comrades on the road to Nebraska. Stay crazy, and I'll salute you. My name's Crazy White, signing out. Peace, comrades. Wink. All right. Good morning. We're about to leave soon. We got everything packed and ready to go. All we need now is something. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but we're going to get out of here soon, and I'll see you comrades on the road. All right? Peace. All right. We, we, we were on the road for about a good 45 minutes. Hang on, ma. What is it? Hi, ma. 
Love yous. Love you. Jason loves you too. Okay. I'll just take a screenshot of this. It's good. God dang. Thumbs all zoomed in. Huh. Mike. What you looking at? Huh. Don't know nothing. <laughs> but yeah, we've been on the road for 45 minutes. We just hit a red hit a rest stop. You know? Bunch of mountains everywhere. Had to use the little crazy Wyatt's room. But everything's all good now. What, what are you doing over there? Look at all the truckers. <laughs> yeah, alright, but I'll see you comrades in the car. <laughs> Alright, we're, we're taking a break. We're actually in New Mexico at this point and I didn't even see a sign but we're just, we're at a food mart right over there. Hang on. Food mart! So generic. Yum. But we're just gonna, everyone else is out taking a piss and I'm just, I'm just here by myself. Yeah, I know. I don't, I look weird today, but nobody told me it was a party. Well, I kind of knew. What am I talking about? I got snacks. I might start snacking down. What do we got in the menu today? Oh, I, sh I should eat some raviolis, hell yeah. Actually, you know what? You know, all this, this whole backpack is just a bunch of s just sweets and treats for your feet, but not your niece. Because she likes to eat all the freaking food before anyone gets a try. What am I talking about? I don't know. Uh, I'll ch this is a checkpoint. So I'll see you comrades at the next checkpoint on the road or in Nebraska. We should be there pretty soon, actually. There's some creepy guy behind me. Huh. <laughs> all right. See you comrades in a second. Oh, God. <laughs> That's nasty. Oh yeah, we just got back from eating some lunch and... Ain't that right, Mike? Huh? Ain't that right? What? Nothing, nothing. That's... Nothing? <laughs> yeah, we, we kind of ate at that place right there. We had was A&W. Get out the way, Mike! Get out the way! <laughs> Long John Silver and A&W. Got myself some, some good old fashioned root. Hell yeah, man. Hi. What you doing here? Hey. Do you want me to drive? Are you good? I'm drunk. I can, I can drive. Give me the keys. Yeah. Give me the keys. I can drive. How about you? Give me the keys. I'll let you have a little rest. This is, Where am I? Why does my head hurt so much? Ah. Uh, all I remember was being on the road when we ate some lunch, and then I passed out. Is there a motorcycle out there? I don't know what's going on, but I'm gonna get some new clothes on, eat something, take a shower, which my stuff is here. Very surprisingly, and then we're gonna explore the neighborhood. We made it, comrade. We're in Nebraska. Yeah. All right. 
Let's go check out the neighborhood. Oh, hey comrades, how you doing? Yeah, I got some news for you guys. This is actually day three. <laughs> I know, I, I kind of skipped the first two days just so I could get into the groove of things. But if you see behind me is the playground where I broke my leg when I was a child. See? Uh, memories, we're, we're at the park. I remember all of this. This is so freaky, like look at this beautiful long. Look at this area. Ah, oh, especially in the winter winter time, it's just gorgeous. You know what? I don't need my shoes. Screw that. The grass is so soft. That was upside down for a second, my bad. Oh man. Welcome to Nebraska, comrades. Hey, you know what? Just for old time's sake, let's break our leg. Why not? <laughs> All right. <laughs> <laughs> Remember me, Slide? I'm, oh god, I'm so tiny! I'm gonna break my leg! <laughs> oh! <gasps> squirrel! Hi, Squirrel! How you doing? <laughs> I, saw, I saw some rabbits earlier. Some bunnies. Yeah. Uh, uh, Greg does not live near near the park. Well, it kind of does, but I, I, me and Morgan saw our neighborhood the other day. Oh, this thing! No way! I love these things! <laughs> Hang on, I gotta, I gotta be a child for a second. Hang on, guys. Let me, uh, let me get my shoes and turn them into props. Yes? <laughs> okay. Yeah, plus I need to get out of the house, out of Greg's house. Or not really, I just, I just needed a break from the freaking kids. God, this, it's windy. Crap. <laughs> no! It's windy, guys. What do I do? I'll just use my, I don't know, my flip-flops. Oh. What the heck? <laughs> this is so weird, but also, like, crazy nostalgic. Come on now. Come on now, don't be like that. Oh, I'm, I'm just gonna be playing over here. <laughs> Construction worker wide is on the scene. <laughs> Shut up, let me have this. <laughs> then you gotta bring the load, Frank, bring the load over here. All right, you got it. Up. <laughs> <laughs> it's Yogi, I saw a Yogi bear. Alright, I'll be taking that. I don't even I don't even need my shoes today. I'm gonna walk on the grass. Oh my god. Guys! This is beautiful. Ah, oh, there's a guy over there creeping on me, but you know that's okay. <laughs> Oh wait, what's this, what's this park called? I need to... <laughs> Northfield Park, baby. <laughs> Excuse my running. I'm supposed to be on vacation, not going for the Olympics. <laughs> ow, 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 ow. Northfield Park, Charlie Fenster Arbitorium or something. Uh, yeah, this is all coming back to me. This is crazy. Nostalgia and memory lane. This is great. Like, let's, let's, let's get this from a, like a horizontal perspective. Oh. Dang, the grass is still green. The tank is clean, the sun is shining, the tank is clean, wait, the tank is clean! Oh yeah, you see that mountain in the background? Apparently that's part of the Oregon Trail, the Nebraska Monument. I mean, I didn't know that, I just thought that was there for de decorations. Oh yeah, there's the tunnel. I think that's where I found like a two-headed lizard or something. I don't know if that's true. 
but I'm gonna find out what's in that cave, what's in that tunnel. Yeah, this place is like really relaxing. The best place for a vacation. What do we got? Well, now this just reminds me of Tucson. <laughs> Echo! Would they get mad if I peed down here? <laughs> I gotta go. <laughs> but I'm actually pretty thirsty. Oh my gosh. So beautiful. So beautiful. Like, it's so vast. And so relaxed. Vast and relaxed. That's the way I go. <laughs> At least when Crazy Wyatt's not doing anything. But this just goes on for a while. Oh yeah! Oh gosh, sorry. <laughs> oh yeah! There's uh, there's something a little bit further down that's like under construction. It was like a, a, a fountain of something. I don't know, some sorts. And it was just, it, it was under construction when me and Morgan were kids. And there was like water, it was kind of cool. They said it should be completed. <laughs> Better be, it's been 13 years. It's a long time. <laughs> it's a long time, oh yeah grass. The grass feels nice and moist. Like, I could just drink from the water. Oh, there's a bunny wabbit. Hi, bunny wabbit. <laughs> He's like, what is that? Is that the internet? <laughs> Almost. Yeah. It's so nice. It just feels good on my feet, you know? It feels good between the feet. It's a documentary, but also a memory log. And as soon as I'm done showing you guys like this big old vast park, I'll go, I gotta show you my school, Northfield Elementary, but also Longfellow. That school was huge. Also uh, Josh and Jordan's house and the old neighborhood where we used to live. Hello bird on a wire. What you doing up there? Hi, oh, doggy. Oh, you're fluffy. You look like Chica. Oh, oh burp. <laughs> yeah, I bet the winters, I miss the winters here. Winters here are awesome. Playground still intact. Nothing changed. I like that. <laughs> but the weird thing is, it, it kind of, it kind of still feels like, it still feels the same, but it feels like smaller, if that makes sense because now I'm a, I'm a big Crazy Wyatt instead of baby Crazy Wyatt, little Crazy Wyatt. <laughs> so I'm a big boy Crazy Wyatt, who knows what being aware is and... Oh man, that's beautiful. It's so peaceful. And the thing you probably notice, it's more cloudy. It's more cloudy here than uh, Tucson, which I'm thankful for because, you know, I need a break from the sunshine and everything's all pretty like there's so much grass like every house has grass there's a trampoline over there <laughs> oh the bridge oh guys I get to show you the bridge heck yeah oh it's so nostalgic I hate it and I love it I don't know why I don't get it I don't understand it, it looks so much bigger when I was a kid everything looked so much bigger growing up huh like if you guys you guys had a hometown that you moved away from and you liked it very much share it uh oh someone's on a bike they're chasing me just act natural All right. Ah, is that Dookie? Dookie! Better watch where I step. <laughs> let's, let's go on the bridge. 
the bridge. Oh boy, I wish I had a bicycle. I need a bike. I better put my shoes on. This place is freaking nostalgic. Woo! Ah. Oh. place is amazing. Oh yeah, the fountain should be down that, that road trail. There's a house. Man, I gotta, I gotta get out more. <laughs> what am I doing with my life? I miss, I miss Nebraska. <laughs> yeah, there, there was this, uh, there was this funny picture I saw. It said something's like a traveling joke or something. It was just, this person's like, you're just depressed because you're in your bedroom all day and you're just depressed because you stay in your bedroom all day and you don't travel the world. And this guy, this other guy's like, uh, cool, now I'm depressed in Egypt. And he's just like frowning but right in front of like the statues of pir the pyramids, <laughs> like the, the sphinxes and stuff, or the, the one where they're laying down, I don't know. But it's like, <laughs> great, now I'm depressed in Egypt. I'm traveling like you said, but now I'm still depressed. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna follow this trail and see where it takes us. If it takes us to the fountain of youth, I'm gonna be happy. Oh, are they at the fountain? I think they're messing around the fountain. Not not like that. This place is freaking nostalgic. It's got a boat. Man, it's trees. I miss this place. Oh, there's the fountain. They're playing with squirt guns, typical. What's this? English Oak Memorial to Dirk Bowman given by United Methodist Sunday School 2014. Wow. Interesting. Not bad. I'm gonna look around some more. Oh, we got a blister. Ew. I'm gonna shake it off Wyatt. I'm gonna follow this trail. Oh, the fountain's ready. I'm gonna check this out. Wow. <laughs> I'm gonna go do cartwheels. <laughs> Fountain's over there. I walked past it. I saw a snake. No joke, I saw a snake when I was when I was trying to, to take a dump in the woods. It was, it was actually behind a dumpster. Yeah, I was I was being sneaky. Okay, jeez. Kind of stinks. It, like, like like it constantly. Shut up! It constantly sneaks. It, it constantly smells like cow dung and fertilizer. I mean, I'm kind of used to it, kind of, just a little bit, but not like overly used to it. I guess if we could keep going down this way, there's a like uh, there's this weird hill. When when it snows, it's like super wide, and then there's another hill which is like vertically, like it's it's very steep slide. And every time during the winter, every, everybody would like gather there, and they would just start sledding. I remember, uh, I remember that I, I ran over some kids, but I also got run over when I was a kid <laughs> by sleds. I think I remember another story where I like accidentally kicked someone off their sled and just like hijacked them. <laughs> I'm like, give me that sled! Wah! He took, he stole my sled! Wow! I'm like, yeah, big, big deal. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, big deal, grow up. <laughs> oh, God, still stinks, man. <laughs> I mean, I mean, I'm outdoors. It might as well be healthy. There's, I've never seen so much green in forever. And talking about trees, life, not money. You freaking greedy bastards. 
Jeez. But I still love you guys. No matter what. <laughs> no matter what. Oh yeah. Sunflowers bloom especially in this region. So that's, that's just a handful. But but you know there's there's some more over here. And it's just like it's Nebraska's like an open world kind of open like more nature. It's more relaxing and like everyone's more friendly. No offense, Tucson, but you know, um, the heat kind of gets to us all. But it's it's actually pretty like chill. Not not chilly, but like the weather's like seventy something degrees, maybe like eighty on a worst day or something. That'd, that'd be a great place for a picnic. But I just, I'm just looking for a fertilizer. I mean, a a fountain. God, how long does this trail go on? I gotta pee. <laughs> I mean, I can hold it. I'll hold it for you, comrades. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna need to drink too. It's, I, I kind of, I kind of got lost, so I backtracked. I'm like, oh, I found it. <laughs> and Josh and Jordan, when I found them, me and Morgan, it's uh, they, they look so different. I mean, they still look the same, but they were more buff and they had more, you know, they had more chin hair. They had more face hair. Josh was, I mean, Jordan, was it? no, it was Josh. Josh was the really buff one. He's, he looks like Vin Diesel or The Rock had a love child. And uh, and Josh, I mean, they both have glasses. And Josh has, uh, I mean, Jordan. Jordan has glasses, too. They both got glasses, but Jordan's, like, a little bit slimmer, but he's got more meat on his bones than I do. So they're brothers, and I, I want to ask him. Oh, this is getting pretty creepy. Creep, not not creepy, creepy. <laughs> it's a what was I saying? It's a swamp. <laughs> oh yeah, they their dad had a farm. Apparently, like there were like little frogs me and Morgan would play with, and they'd pee on our heads if we picked them up or something. Like I remember putting one on my head and it peed. I was like, ah! wait a second, is this the steep hill? No, it can't be. I don't believe it. No. I don't believe it one bit. I gotta pee, but hang on. What, what was that? Thought I saw something. Uh, what was what was I getting on about? Hello. Contributors contributors to the Jaring Pathway, Nebraska statewide, Auditorium, Boy Scouts of America, Regional West. Medical Center found, Omaha World Herald found, Nebraska Machinery Company, Carol Bangentrier. <laughs> cool. Why is it like a chair? It's like a throne. I don't know. Yeah, there's a farm with frogs, but that was just a side thing. The Whoa! Hi, kitty. Hi, kitty. I hear you got something around your neck. You trying to, trying to pounce me? I see you. I see you, kitty. Yeah, they had, a, it was like, so, yeah, they had a farm. <laughs> Hi, kitty. You trying to play with me? I see you. <laughs> the comrades see you, too. We all see you. <laughs> Come out with your paws up. What was it doing? Oh, yeah. On that farm, they had some frogs, and they peed on my heads. Wait, is this it? Is this the freaking trail? No way. There's a bathroom. I'm gonna sit down for a second. Oh snap, this must be it. it. It's so much weirder than I remember. But it's still there. I think. I don't know, it's kind of weird. Like that, that big old vest. I don't know if that's the one. It could be. And the cat's pouncing around over there. And then, yeah, there was, a, there was a farm. I already talked about the frogs. They had these, like, inside the barn. It was like, they made this huge roller coaster out of like these connects. It wasn't Legos, it was just like connect pieces. And they, uh, it was all like hooked up to batteries too, so you could make a roller coaster. And if I was this small, I would have a blast, you know? Shrink me down so I can ride that thing. Shrink me down, please, I wanna see the world big again. Where's that kitty? I'm like two seconds from chasing it down and petting it. Oh, I think this is it. Yeah, yeah this has gotta be it. Whoa. Oh, snap. Yeah, so over there is like the Oregon Trail. 
I guess. I never knew that. Some, something about a Nebraska monument. But this is where we used to sled. Believe it or not. High voltage. TNT. I'm dynamite. TNT. I'm gonna win that fight. <laughs> TNT. I'm a power load. There's something on my arm. Never mind, it was just my hair. Dude, I remember this. Oh, this is it. This is the steep slide. Like, imagine all this covered in snow. And then this is just like a very steep slide. Oh man, tech freak. That would have been nice during freaking Christmas, right? Or during the winter. Just going straight down. And then this this path over here, this is where all the uh where everyone would be. Like instead of single file like the one over there, this one would be all all out with people. Some kind of like clash royale kind of thing with shields or sleds. I call them shields, I don't know why. <laughs> Because they look like shields. Well, it's pretty creepy. There's a face in that window. Just kidding. I don't see no face. Ow. <laughs> Ow, what is this? Uh, I remember what this is. Like, this is, this is, you know, where everybody went sledding. So just imagine all this in snow. Whoa, this is a surprise. Sunflowers. Cool. Glass. Cool. What's that say? This structure paid paid for by Garing Keno Funds, John Fertig Jr. Builder, contributor Steve Dogte, and Dale Manach. And the guy says the best. I don't know who those guys are, but I really gotta pee. Hello, flower. Oh man, this is this is the snow place where I got run over and did some of the running over. This was crazy back in the day. This was like a war zone. Oh, I miss it so much. Ooh, that's so pretty. Look, it's so clean too. It's kind of funny because, what is it? Like there's this little zigzag thing in the middle. And if you, I know I, I gotta finish playing Mercenaries 3 or like at least restart it clean with some better recording equipment, which I'm saving up for by the way. Um, if you know the PLAV, the Gorillas from Mercenaries 2, and their, their base, it's got like a zigzag thing when you go up their mountain. That's what it reminds me of, just their giant mountain top base watching over the, the rest of the, oh, I'm zoomed in again. Forgot, sorry. Keep scaring myself and you guys. But yeah, that's what, it, that's what all this area is in the freaking park. Man, this thing goes on forever. Or it's, it doesn't go on forever, it's just long enough to keep you interested, I think. Or it keeps me interested because it's such a memorable time of my life. Plus this, this area is just one of the most hectic ones, but most fun, one of the most fun areas. People, people staring at me, thinking I'm crazy. Oh, they got that right. I'm crazy, why? What's up? <laughs> Wait, is this their house? Oh, no, that, I thought that was just like a, a house and they just owned this place. We'll look both ways, comrades. Gotta, gotta be safe. Is, it, is there like a, oh, no way. You guys are in for another surprise. The Union Pacific train. I mean, I didn't know what it was at the time, but we went inside it, I think. This little train here. Whammy, oh, there's no fountain. There's just, there's only, I guess a, hello? <laughs> Anybody home? All right, hang on comrades. I got a, I got a tinkle. Uh, I'll be right back. All right. Crazy Wyatt's back. Back in black. I am wearing black, actually. Well, actually, you guys should look at the back of the logo on my back. See? It's like a shark. Well, these, these are like sharks. It, it doesn't fit the mood, though. <laughs> I mean, this is clearly not Hawaii or, like, Jamaica. Am I allowed to get on here? Yeah, or is it, like, against the rules? Is there an... Oh. Nope. <laughs> it's locked. <laughs> Of course it's locked. Union Pacific, baby. <laughs> cool. Visitor information to Western Nebraska. That kind of looks like Tucson. Dang, this is bringing me back. Wait, is it opened on that side? Or is there, yeah, there's another lock. Well, at least we tried. 
Let me, let me just uh, get a good look at this thing. <laughs> All right, there it is, the rest area. That's cool. Not bad. But I think, I don't know if we were able to get on it or inside of it last time, but I don't know why I remember getting on it. <laughs> Hello. Oh, that's, that's pretty cool. It's not creepy at all. It's locked. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, that kind of concludes this area. Oh, look, there's Northfield Park. Uh, it looks like nightfall from here. And, ow, I stepped on some like tall, pointy grass. Owie. Let's go look at the sign. And then I'll, I'll teleport you guys to the future. How does that sound? Does that sound good? Sounds good with me. Alrighty. I'm just really thirsty right now. I should have brought a water bottle. Something. I don't know why I have the energy right now. I just, I ate a whole bunch of pizza. Papa John's. I had like four slices and like some crazy bread and like two cheese breads. Northfield Park and Arbor or is Arbitum? Ar I don't know. I said it earlier. I, I, I don't know. But uh, let me uh, teleport you, comrades, to... I'll teleport you to a new destination. It's going to be random, so be prepared. Ah! Okay. We're back. <laughs> but this is just like a temporary thing. I, I forgot to show you guys the fountain. Was this under construction or something? I don't remember. No, I'm just going to jump in it. Oh, hi, little buddy. How you doing? Ooh. Whoa. Yeah, I don't know why, but this was like... Oh, jeez. This was under construction a long time ago. It, it looked so much bigger as a kid. What the heck? Whoa. I'm going to fall in. <laughs> I don't know if I should trust this water. I got a blister on my foot. You know, I'm gonna trust it. I'm gonna trust it. Ooh. Nice. Oh, that feels so good. Ah. Oh. Oh. Yes. But I'm still thirsty. <laughs> You know what I'm thinking? I don't know. I don't, it's kind of green. <laughs> I don't know if I should drink it if it's green. But it, it feels good. It feels really good. Oh, yeah. This seems so much bigger, though. I mean, I'm not disappointed. I'm just, like, confused. <laughs> I'm conflicted. Like, like, wasn't this bigger before? Everything's big when you're a kid. It's kind of a weird conundrum, but it is kind of true. It's very true. Truer than water itself, if you ask me. All right, let's go to a new location. All right, we're coming up on my, uh, my elementary school where I uh, went to school, Northfield. Dun, 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 dun. But the sign is like over there somewhere. It's like all the way that way in that corner over there. No, no, that's not the sign, but you know. It's a beautiful neighborhood. It feels like like kind of Nuketown, but also kind of just suburbia, if that makes sense. I mean, Nuketown is technically suburbia, so I guess that's a win. But yeah, it's, it's pretty nice out here. This is Northfield. Northfield Elementary. I'm gonna I'm gonna go right. Look both ways. N not a through street. What are you talking about? What you talking about, Summers? Hmm. Yeah, I also forgot to mention uh, there's a curfew apparently, like around 10 o'clock for everybody, because there's been like I guess murders or something. I don't know. That's all I've, like rumors I've heard. 
I don't know for sure, but after after I show you guys Northfield, then I'm gonna go back home, and then tomorrow, Sunday, is the wedding for Greg. That's why we came out here, but also for vacation. Oh, and oh, there's a car coming. Ah, 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 run! Oh, it's going the other way. It's going the other way. Thank goodness. I think I remember coming here, like one, like it was a, a school day. <laughs> or no, it was. It's, we thought it was a school day, but it was like it was like freaking. It was like a. Uh, it was snowed in, so we just we got all our stuff ready, and as soon as we got there, it was closed <laughs> for the day. So we're just like, really? We came to school, got up early on a on a freaking snow day. What kind of baloney, baloney shaloni is this? I'm kind of, I'm kind of dry. I need some water. So beautiful, so clean. Gosh, so nice. First day of school, my teacher gave to me one paper chicken. Why is that a thing? I don't know what that means. Take it away, bird. <laughs> chop, 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 chop. There's the playground. Right here. So it's more over that way, you know. But here's, here it is. I don't remember this being here. Where'd all this fancy technology come from? Elementary, baby. Solar eclipse, huh? Monday, August 21st. Really? Really? Are you serious? I mean, it's almost a full moon today. Birdie. <laughs> Dude, this is freaky. Can I even be here? <laughs> I don't know. I'm just gonna like walk around. I think it's, I mean, today's Saturday, so no school today. Ha ha. But it's just so weird to see all this. Ah, oh, the wind feels so nice. Comrades, come to Nebraska. Crazy Wyatt is on vacation. Crazy Wyatt is relaxed, Wyatt. <laughs> Hell yeah. Hell yeah, man. Hell yeah. So this is what happens when you leave Nebraska. <laughs> oh, you become crazy Wyatt when you go to Tucson. Actually, if you go to Tucson, you become crazy. Oh, they better have water fountains there. I'm freaking parched. Are there, are there water fountains? I will trespass. <laughs> I will trespass. Dude. Oh, they got tires? It's like an obstacle course. That's ridiculous. Whoa, my hands. Wow. Look at that. No sunset. But there's the, the Oregon mountain. Where's the, where's the water fountain at? I don't know where the water fountain is. Where's the water fountain? Water fountain. It feels, it feels so weird recording because <laughs> I never had a phone back here when I was a kid. <laughs> I was too small to know what, how to use one. Da do da. Oh, it's so weird. Dude, where's the water fountains? I will hop this fence. No? Okay. I guess I'm walking home then. So that's that's my, my elementary school. What else should I show you guys? Mm, I, got, I still got. I've been. I'm, I've been walking around trying to find uh, my old neighborhood, but I, no luck yet. And then I also got to show you Nor, uh, Longfellow. I don't know if it looks the same, but it's still there. So, uh, and I got to get home because I'm thirsty. Oh no, roadkill! Come on! <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I needed to do that. It was totally necessary, huh? <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> yeah, sorry. I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and knock it off. Okay. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna head home. Get some. Shut up! <laughs> Shoot. I'm gonna head home. Get some water. And, uh, I'll see you comrades at the wedding tomorrow. And then hopefully we'll go see the, uh, what is it? We'll see the, uh, the old locations, the, the rest of them at least. 
there's the old neighborhood and North uh, Longfellow. So we already got the park. We got the the everything in the park. <laughs> and now we got Northfield. I still got to show you guys the inside of Greg's home where we're staying right now. <laughs> I promised Tech Freak I'd show you the setup that's, that they're rolling with, that they're rolling in. They got a projector, that's all I'm going to give. But I'll see you comrades tomorrow at the wedding. Bye bye. Stop the presses. Comrades, I just found Ramona Drive. Ramona Drive. That's the that's the old neighborhood. So we're gonna hit that real quick and then I'll say goodbye. See, here it is. Ramona Drive. It's kind of hard to see, but it's right there. Ramona Drive. Ramona Doctor. Let's do it. Okay, so where is it? Hi doggy. I wanna go across the street over here. Oh man. So this is where it's at. Oh my gosh. I had a lot of weird memories here. It's a, it's a fire hydrant. I think this used to be Tate's house. Tate was my friend growing up. And if he's watching this, then hey man, how you doing? <laughs> yeah, I hurt myself a lot at his house. The Jokels. The Jokels, that's what it said <laughs> on their lawn. Yeah, I had some friends in this neighborhood. There was... Tate, Jeremy, I think there were two Jeremys, there was Emma and Odessa, and Josh and Jordan, and I'm going to show you guys their house real quick, oh, as well as the house I was staying at, oh my god, this is crazy, I don't, hi kitty, hi kitty, are you the same kitty cat from earlier, that, that came up to me, and so friendly, and I started petting him, he didn't, he wasn't scared of nothing, he just walked up, he's like, hey, pet me, <laughs> Pet me now, I demand it. Give me love. Doggies. Oh crap, yeah, this, I think this house, Jeremy's, uh, there was a trampoline, like you could, there was no fence, you could just walk into someone's backyard. That's how like peaceful this was growing up. And then this is, I don't know whose house this is. <laughs> but I remember this is Josh and Jordan's, this light blue one right here this one with the the blue SUV I wonder if they're inside if they are I want to say hi and you guys get to meet them too but also that that house right there that's that's that, that it looks so different but I remember I remember it so well there's so many memories I'm gonna I'm gonna knock on their door and <laughs> see if they're home I had to go to the backyard to knock but hopefully they'll be there hey Hey! Oh, crap. What's up? Dude, what's up, man? What's going on? <laughs> How you doing, buddy? <laughs> Who's this talking about? You do the comrades. How you doing? This, this here's Josh. <laughs> Growing up, he was... I remember him and Jordan. Oh, my gosh. The time fly. <laughs> now he's all buff. <laughs> See, I was going to challenge him to an arm wrestling contest. And he's probably going to beat me, but, like, look, look, look at my arms. <laughs> Mine's just like a twig. And... Uh, I, I was I was talking about like the uh, the farm, like the the connect roller coasters. Oh yeah. Where where was the farm at? I forgot. Um, it's like oh about five miles um, east. They go out on a. I'm terrible. I'm terrible at explaining directions. No, it's okay. I'm sorry. It was like pressure. <laughs> Stop it down in my face. <laughs> It was a. Uh, I've been out there a long time now. Yeah, it was. I remember the the frogs that would like pee on our heads. Like it, <laughs> me and Morgan would be playing with the frogs, and then they we like put them on our heads for some reason. They get scared, like these little these little tiny frogs, and they they get like scared and they like the feel just dripping. Like what is this? Ah! 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 It's not lemonade. Ah! <laughs> Or, or the the connect roller coasters. I, I, I can't get over that for some reason. It was just like it was so. I love connect, man. Those things you build, you like build really cool roller coasters, <laughs> and like they were connected to batteries too. And there was like it was just already working. Like it was it was a mini tycoon. It was pretty cool. <laughs> it was awesome, man. And like I wish I was that small. I wish I was a Lego guy size, <laughs> so I could just like fit inside a roller coaster and just 
just go on my merry way and it's like, <laughs> there's so many cool things you guys built and i, I just i miss yeah, that yeah, I, mean, I miss it too i miss being a kid <laughs> Oh, there's, there's always the inner kid inside of us. I, I was I was just at like Northfield over there, just like wow, it's we went there. Like what? I was like, where's where's Longfellow? I don't remember Longfellow. Well, I mean, I do because they wouldn't let us play on the playgrounds in the mornings. Me and Morgan would always get busted. Like on the on the first day, we'd be like we drop our backpacks and run. Kids are like lined up for some reason, like they're about to get executed. I'm like, what the? F I don't know what they're waiting for. I'm gonna go on the swings. I'm like, there's a there's a glider too or something. It was, it was weird, but it was like, like, it was. I don't know where it's at. I gotta look it up. It's it's so cool, man. Oh, sorry if I'm taking up your time. You, you need to go anywhere right now? Uh, I'm just gonna do my cheat meal, man. Oh yeah. yeah. Uh, I, I, won't, I, I won't tell a soul. It's classified. It's locked in Area 51. They ain't getting in there. The recipe, nor the Krabby Patties. So. One, one on one on Saturday, and then I do like runs on Saturday, and then Sunday night I do uh, Subway. Otherwise, it's all oh. strict diet. Oh, <laughs> I mean, I like that. I mean, it's like running and stuff all over the parks. I was just at the park too. Like it was so vast. It was like, <laughs> what, dude? I I remember that. Oh, and the wedding's tomorrow. Make sure you're there, oh, man. Yeah, I'll be there for sure. Oh, is is Jordan inside too? Yeah. He's probably, he's, yeah, in the garage. Oh, <laughs> is he like working on something or sleeping? Yeah, he's listening to music. He's like, da, Shit, da, yeah, da, da, just, yeah da. having a session. <laughs> oh, is it all right if I, I ambush him real quick? Yeah, I'll let um, me. I don't want to like intrude. I, here, let, I'll go through this way, man. I'll, I'm just going to, I'm going to document everything. <laughs> I'll meet you right back. All right. <laughs> We're in business. <laughs> so you guys are about to meet Jordan. Hello. <laughs> Shush now. It's gonna be a surprise. <laughs> Hello. Here's the dock. Is it upstairs or downstairs? Oh, there he is. <laughs> I forgot there were <laughs> stairs right there. <laughs> He's coming. Ding dong. <laughs> <laughs> you just walk over here yourself then? Yeah, I was just, I just needed to get away from everybody there. I'm just like, you know what? I need some fresh air. Yeah. I've been... Oh, uh, well, not much fresh air, really. <laughs> yeah, I you don't miss a Nebraska oh. smell. <laughs> <laughs> I know. All I smell is just a cow dung. But, you know, it's, it's, it's special, I it's guess. That's it. It's like whoa, whoa. every day. But isn't that like good smell? I mean, there's the grass. There's a lot of grass. There's got to be a good sign. There's flowers and grass everywhere. It's like that means, you know, that's a good sign. The poop is making everything grow. <laughs> what really sucks is that's what I get to smell every day before work at twenty four seven. Yeah. Oh God. Good that's morning. Work out. <laughs> what kind of crap is this? It's, it gets really bad too. It's worse than this sometimes. This is like a, a farm somewhere, just, <laughs> just like pumping out all these. Like, <clears throat> what are they feeding them? Just like animals, cows, bulls. They're just like mushing it into one giant pot, crock pot. Just, <laughs> they're like, yep, that, that, that can kill. <laughs> that's 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 a toxic virus. <laughs> that's what uh, Umbrella Corporation should have done. They should have done that. They should have like got these files of. I don't know, like, <laughs> cow junk, and they inject it, like, they become a cow dead zombie. Hey! What's going on, man? Oh. No, just a little filming some stuff. I've been, I've been walking around all over the place. I was like, where's Ramona Drive? Like, where's the old neighborhood? I love the old neighborhood. I went to the, I walked down to the park. I walked down to Northfield. I walked everywhere. <laughs> walked so many places. I'm like, maybe, maybe if I'm lucky, I could run into these guys again. I'm like, oh, it's been so long. Like, oh, I know. Hey, you guys. Sorry, I'm just getting your chest. All you see is just the head and the chest part. Like, this is a Jordan. It's just his chest. You can tell it's Josh. Oh, wait. They got, they got faces, guys. Come on now. Bring it in. Bring it in. Oh. Oh. Yeah, I know. It might seem weird, but it's all right. I just, I'm just, like, filming all the... These are memories, you know? Yeah. I know it might seem weird. Hey, these are memories. Yeah. Check it. But it's like, 
Uh, like when I'm an old crazy wire and I'm looking back at this, I'll be like, I remember those guys. I'm glad I got them. <laughs> yeah, this is nuts. This is like... I don't know if you'll see you guys yeah, again, honestly. Never yeah. say never. <laughs> Even if you like look the same, it's like, wait a minute. I smell something. <laughs> it's why he comes into town riding on a cow with like cow dung behind him. Just, hold, just tugging a whole bag of just cow dung. It's like, Maybe get you can take it out of here. <laughs> Sorry, uh, Bessie. <laughs> Bessie, get oh, the, yeah, get the dungeons. <laughs> smell was an adjustment for you guys coming back here. Yeah, I, I didn't even know it's like, I don't remember if it did as a kid. Like it smelled. It could have. I don't. I don't, I don't remember. Some some areas are way worse than others. I don't think obviously, it's this bad. It was like, like, especially around where the the place where we work out. It's terrible there. Like, oh no! You just get out of the car and it's just. <laughs> it's like oops. Oh god. Yeah, yeah, no, really though. Oh, cracked and went. Oh yeah. god. <laughs> <laughs> this is, oh man. Poop. I mean, if, it, if there's so much methane everywhere, I mean, what if the one guy's like, hey, I got a lighter? No! Yeah, that would that'd be funny. I mean, but also bad because then the whole town would light up. Like, <laughs> oh, that would that would be that would be like the apocalypse, <laughs> the, the, the cow apocalypse, the dung apocalypse. I don't know. Oh, uh, and the wedding. The wedding's tomorrow. Yeah. And what better place to have it is at the park. <laughs> like. The bridge. Like, Do you remember the, the bridge? Nice. Do you guys remember the bridge too? Yeah. It, it seemed yeah. so much bigger as a kid. Like it, every, everything <laughs> yeah, seemed so much huge. Like it's. <laughs> I thought the same thing. Yeah. It was, it was just ridiculous. Just, I mean, I loved it. Just, ah. I think they changed it a little bit too. I was actually just there for a picture not too long ago last Sunday. Oh. Uh, Take a picture. Well, well, tomorrow's Sunday, <laughs> and that means a wedding. We used to play football all the time at that park. Oh, we did? Yeah. Well, I don't know. Well, you wouldn't have. Oh, I was, I was too small. I was like, pass me the ball, Charlie Brown. <laughs> Charlie Brown. If you, uh, if you hold the ball like that, I promise you won't move it. Okay, I promise. All right. Uh, you son of a gun. You lied. <laughs> you by any chance remember me babysitting you a few times? Uh, I think so. On occasion. Uh, I mean, was it at, was it at that house over yeah, there? Yeah, yeah. I think I, I think I might remember that. I just, you go to the park, but we, you know, we like go to I, like you guys wanted to go to the park on a couple of occasions, and that was pretty oh, fun. I miss I, I love the park. Even you guys though were entertaining, that was for sure. Even though I broke my leg there, I don't know. I think it's my right leg. Or my Did le you really? Was it my left leg? Yeah, I think it's my left leg. <laughs> and there was this picture, like they put a portrait. It was like like a tub of wear around my foot, and so it looked like my foot got amputated. So it was just like that and a giant sock around it. I was like. What happened to my leg? How, how did it come back? How, whoa, oh, just yeah, no, I was just so over a year ago. Oh no, yeah, I brought the like 65 pounds from clear up here. I was, doing, I was doing these, no, I brought it and the bar flipped oh. right out of my hands. Ah, oh, that um, awesome YMCA's equipment. That's why I'm at 24 7 now. Oh, wait, <laughs> one of the reasons that's right, YMCA, yeah. That's the one where, like, when it was Halloween, it was like we couldn't find any houses, and then they they brought us to like YMCA, and like they were throwing. There was a bunch of mini games inside. You could there was a balloon wall, and you could like throw darts at it, and then they give you a prize. And there was like rock climbing. Dang. I don't uh, know about the first one, but that's I forgot about that. I remember. I remember darts and balloons for some reason, like really? a like a mini carnival, like. <laughs> I don't, I don't understand. I don't remember that one. <laughs> I don't, I don't understand. I basketball all the time now before we oh, start lifting. I think I remember basketball. I've seen you guys outside playing basketball. Oh, yeah, that's all we did. That's all we did. Yep. It was like, that was the best thing, though, because <laughs> it was basketball, you know? You know. Well, that's how, uh, like, <laughs> me and Greg met and, and DJ and everything. Oh, yeah, they DJ! Came they came over. <laughs> oh, man. I remember DJ broke my ratchet and clank game. Oh man! I, I don't know why he did that. Why'd you do that, DJ? <laughs> or, I remember though, anytime you're on, he's like, hey, "Why? I'm gonna chuck the pee pee off." <laughs> oh no! <laughs> no! <laughs> yeah, you, no! Yeah, you, that's right. You got so upset at that. Don't, that was one don't, thing. Don't come like, my pee pee off. <laughs> <laughs> like you never got nervous yeah. about anything, but when he said that, that was like the one thing that you would freak out about. He's like, he's like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna send you in outer space. I'm like, nah. I'm gonna cut your pee-pee off. No, please, I beg you. I beg you, don't do it. That's all I have in this world. I already lost a tooth. What else do you want to take from me? It feels like some like crazy sauce stuff. 
<laughs> so when, when's the last time that you saw DJ? I don't know. That was... I think I saw him in Tucson at one point. I don't know. Like, I heard he was in Tucson. He was staying in Tucson. I, like, when I met him here, I, I thought he was, like, kind of a... Like, at the time, I thought he was a big brother figure. Because, you know, he kind of he kind of looked like me because he was, like, the only blonde guy in the house <laughs> besides Mom. Mom was not a guy, by the way. <laughs> I love you, Ma. <laughs> it was, like, he always... I wouldn't say he taught me how to be cool. I don't know. I, like... He had a skateboard. Well, I remember he had a lot of like he spiked yeah, his hair. He'd play with you and mess around with you and stuff like 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 I was some kind of friendly way. Yeah, it's like I'm just some kind of some tool to toy to him. <laughs> <laughs> or he had a skateboard. And he had like a he put a uh, was it his hat on backwards. Yeah. He like put he it on all me. All kinds of stuff. You know. I was like I was doing a pose like this, We're, like on a skateboard. <laughs> yeah. We're like what's up? <laughs> yep. Or, he was full on into all that back at that time. Or what was it? Like, I woke up in the middle of the night. He had, like, friends at his house. I think he was playing Resident Evil or something. That was me. It was? Yeah. That's oh. what we do. We stayed, like, there was one night. I think we played a game for, like... No, it was uh, Soul Calibur. We played that for, like, 22 hours straight. I, I like Soul Calibur. I mean, there's one with and Darth then, Vader and Yoda. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know which one that one was, but... It was like the only Soul Calibur I I think it was just two. I think it was Soul Calibur 2 at that time. Oh, uh, yeah. it was it was just like, I would sneak into the room and be like, don't tell Dad on me. And I'd like hide under his bed for some reason. <laughs> and then he's like, I was like, all right, I won't tell Dad on you. He's like, is Wyatt in here? He's like, yeah, he's under the bed. <laughs> he's like, what? You, you betrayed me. That's all I, did. <laughs> I trusted you. Yeah. <laughs> it was oh, like man. it was like tough love from him or something. <laughs> yeah. I guess he was he was the closest thing to a big brother, but you guys are like big brothers to me too. Well, that's so, awesome that you said that, man. Oh, you feel good. Thanks, man. Of course, I've always felt that. He's like got my two big my two big bros. It might not be blood, but it's like it's just a connection. There's a, there's a bond. You might not have like like the same family. I was old, like it got to a point where I came over like every day. He was like our our, our true friends, man. There was, was, was like Tate, Jeremy, Emma, and Odessa. And there was another one. I don't know, there was a lot of people. Like, I don't have enough fingers to count. <laughs> there was like so many. I was like, what? <laughs> oh, man. It's, it's crazy. Maybe. Wait, do you guys have any like basketball or football? I love football. I love watching, obviously. I don't partake. I mean, I think we have a basketball, but there's so much grass. I don't. I didn't see a, a basketball court. There's what about a, a grass basketball court? There's just grass. We could just kick a. <laughs> so, we could just kick a basketball around like a soccer ball. <laughs> it, it works okay. <laughs> it's better than nothing. I was trying to play basketball. It's probably early twenties. Man, uh, that would been the last time I uh, engaged in a sport, basically. Sadly, I haven't played in a sport in a long time. Like in Tucson, there's a uh, was it Carson? No, yeah, Carson Middle School. I tried to play basketball, but I was just a substitute all the time. I didn't even like it. Everyone was like all mean and everything. Like Tucson, yeah, I was like a lot of. I think the heat just gets to people. They <laughs> yeah. just they just get all mean, like like really angry. Or something, but I try not to let it get to me. Everyone else is just like, ah, you know, they, they get all angry. And I miss Nebraska, especially when it snows, because like in the fall and when winter, because like, and I remember the Fourth of July too. Like we we sat out in the the front yard. We had we just saw fireworks. Yeah. And they had like lawn that's chairs. That's when we used to get so many and like. We put them in order of how we were gonna do them, and it was, oh, it was like a whole process for us. It was ridiculous. It was just that was beautiful. Fun. That was, it was good times. Yeah, I, I miss those. I, it feels like I wanna, I wanna look at my memories. I wanna go back in time. I wanna go back in time and look at the memories, guys. I wanna <laughs> see. I wanna see all of us. When we were all kids and stuff. I mean. I wasn't smart enough to process stuff. I just like walked into walls and stuff. I walked in the road when there was glass. I'm like, ah, ow, glass. <laughs> I hit my head on a rusty nail at Emma and Odessa's house. Yeah, that's over there, right? Yeah. 
they had a clubhouse that was like really yeah rough. I do. I remember when they had that club. That's right. They did. I totally forgot about that. They had the trampoline too. Trampoline. We used to always play on that. We play uh oh what was it? I mean just tag basically just like you know you jump <laughs> on the trampoline. Somebody would try and hit you and you'd have to dodge or try and catch it. You know. <laughs> Well, yeah, I'm yeah. <laughs> oh, I wish we had that. I wish that was like a required thing for like any school anyone goes to. <laughs> like, okay, recess, get on the like dodgeball your, trampoline. Yeah, like pee. You're no kidding, right? Oh, that, that brings me back. I'm just, I'm sad. <laughs> but, oh, uh, there's so much. I miss it. I miss it all. I miss you guys. <laughs> oh. I don't even know if you guys would even remember us, because when you guys left, you would have been... I remember. I, I mean, remember. how old were you when you left? Like Do you remember it all? They said it was... Five and more than seven. They said it was 13 years since we've been back here. Yeah, that sounds about right. 13, that's... That's too long. <laughs> it's too long. Too, that's 13 I years in Tucson. To this a, day, I still regard DJs. My overall best friend, like you, like, he's, he's, I used to be him, cool. Well, him and Desiree, both of them, because oh yeah, yeah. Oh, she's she's still in Tucson, I think. I've yeah, seen her around. She got like I a bunch of he's tattoos. He's in contact with, and I have done a tear like that, and that's totally my fault, on my part. She's tried to reach out to me multiple times, and I've just never. It's like any time that I have found the time, which is pretty rare, and you know, I know that she's super busy. I don't know. I kind of just get nervous. I just feel. Oh, I yeah, know. that's all right. Uh, or she, she still, I like, I, I remember we saw her, like, at dinner or something one time. We were eating, like, spaghetti. She came over. She had a bunch of tattoos still. She was pretty cool. Yeah, huh? she, I know, she yeah. Got, like, tattoos now. She's got, like, on her arms, her legs, yeah. everywhere. She's, like, she's, like, uh, she's pretty cool. I, I remember I was, I think I was, like, choking on a lifesaver. Like, Mima gave me a lifesaver at that house. It's like, here, why I take this? I'm like, ooh, what's this? And oh, it's like, no. it's, it's a lifesaver. It's like, it's tasty. I'm like, oh, okay. That's ironic. <laughs> but it was, it was weird because I, I didn't know how to ask for help. So I was like, I always thought like dad was the one who would help or something. So I like Don. I call him Don, I guess. Uh, like I was like, where's dad? <laughs> like I was going through doors, like asking, like, you okay? I'm like, I'm out. where's dad? <laughs> he was like, he was, he was in the bathroom taking a dump, and I was like, help me! He's like, puh, puh, blah. I, I don't know why I could just ask someone else who was there. It's like, you can help me, but I want to ask for other help, you know? You know how. <laughs> was, I, I was. I didn't, I didn't make sense. My brain still doesn't make sense. It's, the, the Tucson fi, the Tucson sun has fried my brain, guys. Dude, uh, I was like, back in the house, me and the DJ were sitting in the basement downstairs and I thought somebody was in the bathroom and I was like should I go in there because I gotta go and he's like yeah there's no one in there it's fine walk in there go around there's no one taking this shit like, oh I'm so sorry like it was like I still regard it's one of the most embarrassing moments in my life oh god day. sorry like, I'll leave you and I was piece. so mad at DJ I was just like dude why did you tell me that and he didn't care he's just like oh. he's like whatever man he's like oh, I'm wrong yeah sorry. you saw you saw him taking a dump <laughs> He's like, I feel like he'd be, he'd fit in with like Johnny Knoxville and them. <laughs> he'd be like, he used hey. to watch, he's the one that introduced me to them. That's what he watched all the time. He what uh, it was like Jackass. Yeah. I think there was something before they even had that. Was there something? Wasn't there? Oh, CKY2K, wasn't that it? I'll be back, hey. Okay. <laughs> Sorry about I'll, taking the time. I'll see you when I come back. I'll definitely see you guys tomorrow. We'll for sure be there. Oh yeah, we'll, we'll be at the wedding. All we'll right. all be there, and we're gonna have okay. a good swell time. I better catch them before they close. Sorry, I keep, I keep, I keep no, taking dude. your time. It's good <laughs> seeing you. It's good seeing you too, Josh. Sorry for taking your time, buddy. Oh, dude. Oh. Oh. I miss you guys. It's been. This is nice. This helps my soul. Helps my soul out. I'm like, ah, oh, finally, it feels so much better. I needed this. Oh. I, I missed a tooth. I forgot. I'm like. <laughs> you had to tell us a story how, you, how that happened to you. Uh, it was biker gangs from outer space, pirates. <laughs> <laughs> I was saving the earth. What, was, what else was I supposed to do, you know? What else was I supposed to do? It's, it helps. <laughs> oh, man. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. 
You guys are awesome. I love you too. <laughs> like brothers, I never had. Yeah. This is crazy. Like you were just this little kid. Now you're calling <laughs> man. A little little crazy you wife. my line. It's, I know. It's like what? These, <laughs> I remember both you guys. I remember everything. It's like, oh man, it's gonna have. We're gonna have a good time. We're all gonna have a good time. It's like we did have good times. <laughs> Even Ooh, though, like, I should have had a general that. idea of you guys' age. age. Still, when you guys told me your age, I was just like, oh my god. Like, I, I, got, I got to sit down for this. Yeah, pretty much. That really, though, that's pretty much what it was. That is crazy. Like, time flies ridiculously. Oh, it's, it is, I'll tell you right now, it gets worse as you get older. It really does. Yeah, they said, like, it gets, it goes downhill when you're 21. It's like, as soon as you hit 21, it just goes downhill from there. 20, it's somewhere from 21 to 23, yeah. You just start counting, like... More and more, every birthday becomes more of a like a countdown slash, like you just dread the number and you just kind of like focus on the number. Like what's gonna happen next? <laughs> like, sort, but just like the fact that you're getting older and it's just like yeah, yeah. It sucks. I mean, yeah, it is. It's like it's overwhelming because like I want to be a kid forever. Because <laughs> like when we were all kids, it was like the best time to be alive. I think. Pretty much. Yes. Okay. Oh god, I've been doing. I've been recording for 25 minutes. That's crazy. This is a, this is a this is a good this is a good footage. Good comp. Oh, I keep getting your chest this whole time. I'm sorry. This whole time I was just like I've been getting your chest. It's so just like two chests. That's what he looks like, guys. Probably the better. Oh, but it's classified. I'll just I'll just like blur it. No, video's fine. It's pictures <laughs> that I can't stand. There's so, for some reason. Just like, I'm not a. I can't take pictures without looking like a moron. Yeah, I mean I I look like. I'm more on all the time. <laughs> oh, jeez. Ah. Ah, freaking oh, blister. Sure, a... Just a blister. I was walking in these heels for a while. Oh, I was going to say. From, I could I get a band-aid. Get a sticker from freaking yard or lack thereof, brother. Yeah, there's a lot of stickers, like, oh, going man, through the park. <laughs> it's, like, so embarrassing. It's, like, everybody else's yard is, like, green grass. It's, like, dirt. That's okay. I mean, there's so much grass, too. Like, everywhere. Like, it's just... Just, the park is so beautiful, man. That's right. You, yeah. Even though I broke my leg, I'm just like, ah, I'm gonna go back there anyways. It's it's a lovely place. Tucson, man. I I very much enjoyed Tucson both times we went. Like that was a very good time. You guys went to Tucson? Yeah, twice. Do I? Went, went, let's see. I think the. I don't remember when the first time was. Seems like there was, I think, there was one year where we went down there, and then the next year, summer, they came here, and then the next summer after that, we went down there again. And, uh, yeah, but the, <laughs> a lot of good memories both times we went. I, I think both times we were down there for about a month. Huh. Yeah, it was, it was awesome. Speaking of the heat, by the way, the second time we went down, there was one night, <laughs> like... DJ hadn't paid his bill until, like, the power went out. So we oh, had no. no source of entertainment, oh, no, no air conditioning, no, no lights. Nothing. <laughs> like, we had to go out and buy candles and board games <laughs> to keep ourselves entertained that night. It's like and Ouija we boards, man. So uh, bad, like. Oh, jeez. Was... Don't don't play with Ouija boards. <laughs> don't do it, man. Uh, I won't do it. Start getting, like, delirious and hallucinating. Shit. You're seeing candles in the dark, it's like... Dude, did you see that? <laughs> Whoa! They moved something over there. Moved. It's getting closer, man. I'm gonna pass out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Tucson's like freaking, like sometimes it gets brutal, like the heat. It's so everyone just like stays inside, like oh, they just like have a fan or something, or they just go swimming. <laughs> but like when it like in Mount Lemon. When it's like snowing in the winter, you have to drive all the way up there. Sometimes people just grab snow when they're about to leave and they just like get a whole bunch of it and put it on top of their car and strap it down. <laughs> really? I don't know how. I mean, I've seen people like drive down the street when they're not in Mount Lemon just like with all this snow. Like, not trucks, just like cars. It's like, yeah. I don't know how they do it, but it was like, there were trucks too, but it's like, how did it, it didn't melt on the way down? <laughs> it's just like, right? just like, <laughs> That'd be crazy. Like, I love the snow in Nebraska because everything it gets it gets high. Yeah, it's dude. Our weather's so weird. Like 
we almost don't even really have seasons. Like, they don't, they don't I swear, they don't exist anymore. It's, <laughs> it's like, you just, I mean, we've had snow as late as, like, I think this year, I want to say late April or early May, there was a time, there was a few period, a couple of days where there was, like, it accumulated a lot of snow, and then the next day it was just bright and sunny, and then it didn't take long to melt. I mean, that's just how it is. It's crazy. <laughs> it starts hailing one minute, and just, like, sunshine the next. Yeah, that's pretty much, yeah. Weather is weird, man. Weather <laughs> It is so weird. Especially around here. At the same time, though, I will say, we do avoid any, like, serious stuff because of the monument, so that helps a lot. Yeah, I haven't been up there, I think. It's, like, all the, the mountain over there. There's a there's a pathway to just walk all the way up. To, it's, oh, it's pretty enjoyable, pretty awesome. I, like, last few times I went, I got winded just walking up it, which is pathetic, but... That's all right, I mean, like, I'm, I'm, I'm like... When it comes to cardio, oh my goodness, I'm, like, I'm so out of shape. Me too, I'm just, I've been sleeping all day lately, I'm just like, <laughs> I've just been laying down, even when I wake up, I'm just like laying down, I'm like, I gotta do something, guys. Yeah, I'm so bad about that on the weekends, like, sleeping in, like, throughout the week, you know, that's pretty, like, I, I stay up pretty late and get shit sleep and wake up early and... And then on the weekend, I crash pretty much. And play games? Go. No, I, I don't. I really don't play games, which is pretty depressing because, oh, man, did I, that was, like, the thing I did growing up all the time. That was, like, my favorite pastime by far. Is every day, I remember being in school and just, like, there's one that clock to hit 3, 15, or 3, or whatever it was, and... This, this day to be over and walk home. Just, uh, like, just, <laughs> just like, uh, walk home, done. you know. I'd be like walking home, playing games. I'm like, yes. Finally, school's done. I can finally go and play <laughs> and enjoy life. life. Yeah. Like, it's, it's so... <laughs> 31 minutes. <laughs> I keep... I'm, I get ridiculous. Like, the videos, they get kind of long that I make. But they're all memory purposes. I, I make them really long. <laughs> There's going to be one giant shebang. Shebang is gonna be really good, man. Uh, Crazy Wyatt. That's it's a, it's the channel. You should totally look for it, man. I play so many games, and this, this is gonna be one of them. Well, this is gonna be one of the like traveling logs, cause nice. when my when Morgan was in California, when it was when she was like living up there, yeah. Me and my my buddy Alex, we we met in Tucson, and we took a train to California. I mean, we met in Tucson a long time ago, but yeah. We, we took a train like much time after later to go see Morgan and it was it was awesome so it was like we went to California coming back to Nebraska <laughs> it's, it's like we went to Vegas too <laughs> Bel you? believe it or not I was really nervous though because it was just like because there's so many things going on that's yeah. where Morgan and Megan got married and you know and her birthday she turned 21 in Vegas I'm like that's lucky, but we saw the Jabberwockies, or we just like saw them walking around. <laughs> the guys with the masks. Yeah. But they they were they were just like all the same color. It was like just like black sweatpants, jacket, and the hat with the white mask. And then they were they were walking past. I was waving at them. They're like <laughs> they're waving back, and I waved with both hands. They did the same thing, and then they went around, went down the escalators, and before they were going down, I was like doing this, and they were like. They're bound out. I'm like, no way! That was so cool. <laughs> nice. I mean, it was. Crazy. We didn't see Chris Angel, Chris Angel though. We we just saw, like, there's a store dedicated to him. But it's like, really, it would've been cool if you guys were there too. Like, yeah. DJ and Desiree. It's like, it would've been the whole gang. <laughs> like, I was like, oh, oh man, it's crazy. Definitely. Yeah. There's. A lot of places that I'd love to travel to, you know, experience, but I've not, yeah, I've been, like, so horrible about that throughout well, life, of, like, that's all right. traveling places, and, I was and, just nervous to get on the train, I was like, I was just like, like, looking around, <laughs> was like, anyone, anyone trying to plot against me? <laughs> He's got a knife! Oh, no, it's just, it's just a fork. He's got a fork! Oh, he's just trying to eat his meal. <laughs> you gotta throw his fork at me! 
<laughs> oh no, he's just gonna eat his meal. <laughs> or, trains are weird, but planes are kind of cool too. They're they're all cool, but it's like traveling to weird to new places is kind of like. It feels like I'm seeing Nebraska for the first time, but it's like coming back here, it's like, like, oh, I know this place. Yeah. Like, I didn't know everything else outside this yeah. this neighborhood. It's like, wow. Mm -hmm. I was walking around trying to find Romana Street. I'm like, where is it? I was like, oh, there it is. There's the legendary street. Yeah, this place, this area is so weird, too. You know, it's all like name streets and nothing's, you know, like over on that side or over that direction. It's like, you know numbered and lettered, you know, like S and 15th or blah, 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 whatever, 51, you know, like, 52. the here is just like, you know, Ramona, Beverly, and Pacific, Latin. this is like, all oh, these, to, yeah. this, this doesn't make any sense, <laughs> you're confusing Google world, the world's not making any sense, did it ever make sense to begin with? <laughs> Maybe, maybe not, I don't know. <laughs> so all, all that matters is you have fun in life. And just have fun with all the other ones. All the people in life that you meet, just have a good time with them. Like, you guys were a big part of my childhood. I'm like, dang, it'd be great to see them again. And here they are, buff as, <laughs> buff as heck. I'm like, whoa, these guys are my heroes. <laughs> like, oh, snap. Like, they're like, they're like, like a hero duo. It's like... The red, he had, a, he had a white shirt and he had a red, like, back-to-back, -back, but I was like, yeah. <laughs> I can already see, like, a show, like, zoop. Like, he just, he just knuckle hands, like, yeah. <laughs> Some kind of, something really cool. I love, I love coming back here. It's, it's good to see new faces and old faces. Yeah. The, the, the familiar ones, the, the classic ones. You guys instantaneously brought back a bunch of memories when I saw your face in this place. So like the oh, two, like, no, this wow. was a different chapter. Totally the biker gang era, <laughs> with laser swords and alien chicken fingers. I don't know. <laughs> uh, it was just like, yeah, we, yeah, our faces, like, they, they kind of, they do age all of us, like, but they still, even if you're like an old, like old, old lady or old man, like they can still see the faces when they were a kid, and it's just amazing. Uh, it's like it, you just carry that all your life. Yeah. It's like hey, it doesn't matter. We we still we still living. We still kicking. We're we're children on the inside. That's all that matters. But oh, uh, I'm sorry. I, I uh, my my butt bone hurts. Uh, <laughs> yeah, but, sorry. Uh, I took up most of your time. Dude, you were totally fine. Uh, like it was, it was awesome to see you guys. Uh, It'll be cool to talk love, with you guys at the reception, and you know. I, I love catching up with you and Josh. And uh, what happened? I'm curious. What happened to uh, your dad? Oh, actually, it's fun. We just got done uh, visiting him not too long ago, but he's. It's been a roller coaster yeah. throughout the years with uh, him. I that's mean, all right. Uh, ups and downs. Yeah, such is life. Yeah. Things, things do happen. He's but, a character, but you know. <laughs> thing, things can happen, but it's all right, man, because. We're, all of us are family. We're, we're back in the coming bring. I, I'm, I'm hungry for another hug. I, I love my man. I love my guys. If Josh, I might have to. I might go before Josh comes back. It'll be a surprise tomorrow when both you guys show up at the reception. <laughs> no, I got some. I got some weird like clothes tomorrow. We picked them out. I don't know if it, it looks good, but you guys can be the judge of that. I don't know. I mean, it's like shorts and like these weird shoes, and I, I got this weird sleeve thing. I, I don't know. It's. It's weird, but they're they're getting married in the classic park. Yeah, it's gonna be crazy, yeah, man. Yeah, pretty cool. I will admit. I really hope it's good weather for them tomorrow. Yeah, it just starts raining. It starts snowing. No, snow, or maybe fall. It was a year or two years ago. I was at a friend's wedding, and they had an outside wedding. And right when we got there, it just like started pouring. Yeah, it was. Oh. It was so like. Everybody had to get out of their seats, and like everybody was in the a garage <laughs> packed for like forty-five minutes, just waiting, <laughs> and like everything was just getting drenched. They're, and, they're like, know, oh, avoiding, like lakes of rough. water, and they're like, get what, everybody had to have paper towels to wipe off their seats. And <laughs> oh, it was no. crazy. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry, man. No, oh. it was it was an experience. It was yeah. a wide wedding. <laughs> yeah. It's a nice day to start again. <laughs> Oh man, 
That's, it was weird looking back at this house because, like, like it just it just looks it looks so much bigger. And there's a basement too. And I, I remember that DJ. I don't did, know what the layout of that house is now, but I loved it when I like I enjoyed coming over there and just like just chilling, yeah, hanging out. Just the infrastructure of that house and the way it was set up. It's so like classic. It kind of reminds me of like those houses Ed, Ed, and Eddie built. Like in the the, the show, oh, like yeah. in the, the cul-de-sac, <laughs> it's just like they all got the same layout, and it's just it just all looks looks all cozy on the inside, kind of like from the '60s or something. Or <laughs> I don't know, it's just nice. time just did its thing with the house. It looks way smaller. We would always find roly polies over there, and during yeah. Halloween we'd put like a bunch of spider webs up there. Yep, and it just. It's crazy. I remember DJ. He did something really messed up. Usually, <laughs> as as usual, <laughs> like Morgan was getting something from the garage, and a great uh, uh, DJ like pressed the garage button, and it, like came down on Morgan's back. You remember that, sis? Probably. <laughs> oh, there he is back. He's like, are they still talking? I'm like, Crap. <laughs> he knows I'm here. You gotta hide me. Hide me behind your muscles. <laughs> the wall of muscles like I'll save you Ooh. <laughs> it's like ding it's like start shiny I mean I've been trying to get some muscle and just like when I can't sleep at night I just do like push ups or something so I can go. exhaust myself there and then go. I can just go to sleep or, or at least play like some some kind of game something because there's a lot of cool games out there man you still play, you still play video games then pretty frequently oh yeah I play nice. play a lot of games like like Black Ops 3 uh, Friday the 13th. Those are the. That's it. There's a lot of games. Cool. There's still like the Call of Duty games. Yeah. And I know those are fan favorite. Yeah. And and the, I think you know Skyrim. Yep. Yeah. I have a friend who's a big fan of that game. Yep. Dover King. <laughs> Dude, I love that game. It's like it's like I a had weird a, like a an eight month period where I binged on World of Warcraft. I do like World of Warcraft. That that's a good game. Like, I enjoyed it while I played. There, I will admit, it was addicting. I know it's like, and I was I wasn't even good at it. I, I just, did the horrible mistake of picking like a tank. So like, you know, you're like <laughs> responsible for everything. And like, I, I gotta destroy everything, but I'll let the I'll let the medic take out the towers <laughs> or something, and I'll heal them with my tank powers. I'll, I'll, I'll caress them with my tank muscles. There's like, there's like no <laughs> learning curve for that game. Everybody just hates you if you're not amazing right off the bat. They're like, oh my god, he's not even, oh, the toddler. Yeah. What's he doing? Hey, people will like criticize you before I can even like hyper response. It's just, man. It's like, why has everyone got to be so harsh? <laughs> why can't they just relax about it, you know? Because the games are made to be fun and I, right? enjoyable. That's why I stopped playing because like, they, they make because like, people this make is it. A, let's do remember this is a game. This is a game. This isn't a, like a sport, but it could be a sport, <laughs> like esports or something. Because they, they they did that with Call of Duty. For some reason, that's a sport. Like they have they oh, actually commentaries like, yeah, hey, he's going for the big. Oh, God, he just shot it. Oh, he's yeah. got the ball. He's going to the up link. Wow, or something. Video it's, games to this point have just yeah. Everyone's the industry is just exploded. Is, yeah. And it is insane. Especially Friday the 13th. That that game was, like, they based it off the movies, too. Like, it's really? just a multiplayer game for now. But they're adding single player. Like, in the Kane Hodder, who is the original, who is the Jason from Part 7, 8, 9, and X, they used him to record the moves in the game. So, really? Like, nice. the, the kills are pretty brutal, that's, too. That's pretty cool. Like, there's one where you could... Like there's environmental kills. Like there's like a, a patio chair. You like throw them in a chair and you like squeeze them together. Like uh, you make like a counselor sandwich. Nice. And there's one where you like drown them in a toilet. Like uh, uh, you give them a swirly. Like, uh, uh. There's there's just there's just so many kills and like you can actually kill Jason if you're Tommy Jarvis or if you like if you like two two teammates do something yeah. like they work together. But it's like. It's a cool game. It's only 40 bucks for now, but I think it's coming out on Friday the 13th this year too. Nice. I mean, I, I already have like a, a digital one because I, I like pre-ordered it in March. Yeah. And I was like, it's a good, 
I got like a Tom Savini Jason, and he looks epic. He's like on fire. He's like a hell-looking kind of Jason. Hmm. He's got a pitchfork. He's, he's like covered in chains and spikes, and his eyes sure are like on be. fire. He's he's not to be messed with. All the <laughs> you would love him, man. You would love nice. him so much. Oh. I know, I've ranted so much, I'm sorry. Dude, you're fine. Okay. It's cool catching up. I know. It's like, oh, I have so much to tell you from Tucson. The journeys. Some of them, <laughs> a lot, some of them bad, some of them good. I want to tell you the good ones, though. <laughs> I don't want to put any bad ones in there. I want to keep it good. But nice. it's like, uh, I probably over, I probably like drowned your brain and all these, like, whoa, what's, what's happening? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm just excited. I'm like, I found the road. I don't know if I'll find my way back, but I'll look. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm seriously still just surprised that you, like, remember that much of us, because, yeah, I mean, I don't think I remember that much when I was your age. I mean, that's that's awesome you remember all that. Makes you feel good. There's a lot it must have been, I really was over there a lot then, yeah. I, I didn't remember much of a lot of stuff, but I remembered a lot of, like, friends and, like, uh, like when I broke my leg, like events like that, like, oh, I broke my leg, <laughs> I, I broke my tooth. Like those those moments, like, I can never forget. But the good moments, you guys are the good moments. And I'm just like, I can't I can't forget the really pure moments. Like, that was just a, a safe time to be alive, I guess. Like, the best time era in the world. It was just, it was just right, you know. And I'm, awesome. I'm glad I met you guys. I was just like, dang, you made, made my life better. <laughs> made you and Josh. Guys, you're my heroes. All right. That's awesome. Thanks, man. I uh, appreciate. It. I really do. I don't want to waste any more of your guys' time. I'll, but I will see you guys see tomorrow. You, man. And cool. We'll have a good time yeah. tomorrow too. Okay. It'll be a good time. Definitely. Heck yeah, man. <laughs> Sorry for eating up your time. <laughs> you are fine, dude. Seriously. Was, me and Morgan and everybody will see you tomorrow. Yeah, definitely. I gotta go home and probably they're probably mad at me for going out too late, but. I'm thirsty too. I'm gonna I'm gonna get back and and dry my throat or drink my drink. Oh, uh, where's where's the reception again? It's uh it's in the the park I think. They didn't, they didn't tell me too much, but they did say it was in the park. Well, the uh, that's the wedding, but like as far as the because re- isn't the reception? Mm. Did he say it was gonna be? I can't remember where he said that was gonna be. Well, uh, actually, I don't really know. I mean, I could I could text you. Yeah, yeah. Definitely. Want me to get your number real quick? Yeah. Okay. Uh, I gotta pause this real quick. <laughs> Whew. Oh, I love those guys. It was so good catching up. But my battery is running very dangerously low. 19%. But I think this is a good time to end today. And just today's. You know, I guess I'll see you comrades at the wedding tomorrow. Get a good look at the clouds. This was my childhood, comrades. Oh. The Leonards. This place was beautiful. Still is beautiful. Like, the clouds look so big here. Like, all the time. But, yeah. I'm gonna... I'm gonna cut this one down. Head back home and rest up for tomorrow. It's a big day. And... I'll see you, comrades, at the wedding. Hell yeah. Woo! <laughs> Bye bye. Alright, welcome back comrades. Here it is, the wedding day. You see we're just setting everything up down there. Everyone's everyone's looking snazzy. I helped set up all those freaking chairs. 120 of them to be precise. Beautiful. But this is before the wedding actually, so I'll, I'll skip to when it's ready or when it's when it's showtime. All right, see you comrades in a second. Ah, isn't it beautiful? What's going on, comrades? Crazy wide here, back in the flesh. Uh, it's it's the next day actually. <laughs> the wedding was right here, and now it's empty. But you know, we did the wedding. Afterwards, we went to go get some pictures done, and then we went to go eat something. We went to a bar and ate some bar food, and then we went to a reception, and then had a good old time with that. I didn't really want to get out much. <laughs> I was really sleepy this whole vacation. 
Christmas and we leave tomorrow. Today's Monday and this, the, the wedding was yesterday on Sunday. And tomorrow, on Tuesday, we're going back home. But it was nice to come back to all this reminiscent in the moments of my childhood. <laughs> it's a freaking beautiful day. Darn it, how do they do it? How do you do it, planet Earth? How do you stay so gosh darn gorgeous? I don't know. Oh yeah, I kind of feel sick today too. Little throat problems, I woke up. Oh, dookie. Duh. Duh. Why did I do that? Why did I touch it? I don't know, maybe I like dookie or something. What are you going to do about it, huh? You going to do something about it? Look at the sunset. <laughs> Look at the beautiful sunset. Oh, that's beautiful. That's so pretty. Ah. But this concludes Crazy Wyatt's vacation to Nebraska. I know there's a lot of talking and walking. Walking and talking to through all all of the footage, so but I, I think this is like a personal thing for me. So, you know, Crazy Wyatt, you looking back at this? I hope you remember. Hope you get to remember all the good days you had here. Maybe come back. One of these days, I don't know. But it's like way down the road though, when you're like much older. And you got like this epic build, you got like a beard, like muscles, you got all this stuff. But this is still nice, like I like that sunset, that's so pretty. And there's like this weird sense of magic, or not, not really magic, it's just like a sense of overwhelming Christmas. No, not Christmas, just, just you know, just something. Oh, I just uh, ran, ran over some bird, bird crap. But yeah, there's the path goes all the way down there's a guy all the way over there but uh that's gonna conclude it thanks for watching comrades oh before we leave tomorrow josh and jordan are gonna we're, we gotta say hi to them before uh, we take off to, back to tucson so you'll see a little extra after that after this and then and then we can all go home and rest for the night but until then stay crazy and i salute you my name's crazy wyatt signing out Peace, comrades. Uh, 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 oh, it's okay. Uh, we made it back, comrades. Yay! I can't hear anything out of my ears. Oh, God, I'm going deaf. Oh! I seriously I can like faintly hear it and I can hear, barely hear my own voice. We made it. We just got back. What time is it? Hang on, let me, let me find that out. It's 6, 17 a.m. And we've been driving all night long, all day and all night. It takes one, maybe two days, one and a half days to get to freaking Nebraska and back. Um, I don't know, to, to leave, to get there, then eventually come back. It's freaking nuts. But we did it, we made it back. Oh my god. Am I deaf? Because my ears are, like, really hurting. Ugh. Ah, oh, I think they're popping now, but yay! I didn't record much of the wedding, I'm sorry, but I don't know, I just, it was, it was a wedding. I didn't want to interrupt the, the wedding day, so, uh. Plus, there was some pretty good footage. Of, or no, there was some pretty uh, funny stuff that I should have recorded. But then again, I was like, nah, nah. It was it was with Blake. It was I was kind of having a rough time there. Like it was a great vacation. Crazy why I needed this. Except the only screwed up part was like the just waiting in the car on the way there and back. And then when we got there. The only thing that was bad uh, that I'm gonna just complain about, that's it, is uh, the kids. I'm sorry. I'm not a kid person, comrades. I'm sorry. I, I, I held my own though. But like, I remember at the wedding, like after they got married, not, not the kids, the uh, Greg and his new wife, Kylie. Ah, oh god, the air's popping. Ah, I uh, jinxed myself. Oh yeah, after they got married, uh, ow, uh, crap, uh, yeah, Blake was bugging me, 
Uh, I, I, I was I didn't want to deal with his crap that day. He's 14, by the way. Plus, plus he likes to mess with people. Like he likes to annoy. He's one of those types of people. And like in in school, they just like like to poke fun at you. Like they like to poke the bull, if you know what I mean. They like to tease the bull. And I I was giving him so many warnings and so many chances to leave me alone. He ignored them. And you know what? I I uh. I had no choice but to retaliate. I went and Jason on him. I was like, I freaking stalked him. Like, he like walked really fast up to him, grabbed him, or like nothing, nothing neck, but it felt like I did. I was like, like the chest kind of with both of my hands. I was like, you know what? I'm tired of your crap, Blake. So then I raised him up with both hands and then slammed him down back to the freaking grass. Hey, it was grass. It wasn't like hard concrete. So he, he should be grateful. But I slammed him, I slammed that bees notch back down to the earth, to the freaking ground, and he, he still wanted to mess with me. And afterwards, I think he was trying to clean up the wedding, like, after we were leaving, uh, there was like this container of these little bubble things, like you blow after, that they get married, and there was like a whole crate of it, like a plastic bin, and he picked it up, he, he kept trying to nudge me with it, so I'm just like, I just slapped it, and he's like, oh, hit his face with it, he's, uh, to be honest, it was a great trip, and I love going back to Nebraska, but I could not sleep because of those kids, me and Morgan too, like, they would not shut the hell up, no offense guys, if you're watching, but, like, Kylie and, you know, not Kylie, Riley and Blake, maybe, maybe, I don't know, uh, if those two kids are watching, they're like, oh, he's, he's talking crap about us. No, I'm talking truth. I'm sorry, but you know what? Crazy Wyatt ain't taking that. It's bull. It was a good trip, but to be honest, it could have been better without the kids. I rest my case. Say what you want, what you really, really want. Okay, I'll tell you what you want, what you really, really want. I just wanted to enjoy myself. I, I did. That's why I went to uh, Northfield by myself, because I didn't want to deal with the freaking brats. But, you know, that's all. That's the, that's the only bad thing about it. Everything was beautiful. Everything was perfect. Even the smell. The cow dung. That was excellent. That was an excellent smell. Ah! Every time I try to swallow my loogies, my ears pop further. Oh, jeez. Alright, is there anything else I need to say before logging off and go take a giant nap? You thought, you thought I was going to say dump, huh? You guys are nasty. I'm freaking tired. What was I going to do? Oh yeah, my face kind of looks like pizza. Or I got a bunch of like blood. <laughs> I've been picking out my face, guys. Give me a break. My voice feels weird too. Well, is there anything else? Oh yeah, Tech Freak. If if you're, you're still watching, thank you, by the way. Uh, I forgot to show the setup of the, the basement we were staying in. It was awesome. Like, it was underneath, it was like, it was the basement. But it had, like, okay, some, it had carpet. It had a, it had a, uh, what is it? It had an air mattress that we slept on, as well as, like, a couple couches. It had a projector connected to, like, an Xbox. And in, the, in front of it was this giant, like, screen. Not, not a TV, like, it just to receive the projector. Like, it was just a flat white, like, a whiteboard. But there was nothing on it. It was just, it was perfect for playing games. And there were so many other games under it. Like, there were consoles, like a PS, like the classic consoles. There were DS, like, Nintendo 64s, uh, PS2s, a whole bunch of games just lined up. And I, I didn't show it, I'm sorry, but I showed it a little bit, but I didn't really go, like, Welcome, welcome to Greg's crib, you know, it was really cool, like, if the kids weren't there, oh, that would have been the best, like, place to chill, plus, on the, on the double, double whammy good news, there was a toilet, and a shower, like, a, a portable shower, like, in the same, on the same level, like, it was the bed over here, and then when you go over here to, like, the, the concrete area, where the laundry was, and the, the washer and dryer machines, there was also a shower uh, and a toilet. There was no door, so you could be sitting over here watching a movie on the projector while someone's taking a crap or a shower. <laughs> and there's 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 curtains too, 
not really privacy, but I got used to it. I love that shower. It gets hot. Like, seriously, that thing cooks you in there. Oh. Well, yeah, that was... It was... Ugh, uh, ugh, uh, No! I don't want that. Ugh. That's sick. Ah, you're sickening me. You sickened me. Ah, uh, ah, uh, yeah. America. Uh, yeah. I, I don't feel right, guys. I love the trip, but like coming back from it, I feel weird. Cause I, I, it's not what I expected. It's everything felt smaller, but I loved it. But it's like, dang, Josh and Jordan, I met them again, and god dang, they are buff. Jesus. They are freaking ripped, guys. I mean, like, Josh, he's, he's like, Bruh. like, his arms are so buff, he can't even, like, walk without, like, looking intimidating. But he's a really nice guy. I love him. Same thing goes to Jordan. Not as beefy as Josh, but he's still as sweet. They're both just as sweet. They're, they were, like, huge parts of my childhood. They're my childhood heroes. And I guess DJ and Desiree, too. Only because DJ and Desiree were, like, cool at the time. I mean, they are cool. I don't know where DJ is, but apparently things happened. You guys don't know, but I... Oh, oh, better call it a night. I'm gonna go to bed. Thanks for watching, comrades. Stay crazy, and I salute you. My name's Crazy White, signing out. Peace, comrades. Ah!